Welcome to HTV News. Today is Friday, April 20th. I'm Ian. And I'm Carson. And here's what's happening at HHS. HHS bands earned gold and silver ratings at the ISMA Organizational Contest at KV High School. The Intermediate Band, directed by Kelly Raylander and Lauren Takel, earned a gold rating and a gold sight reading award. The Advanced Band, directed by Brian Grenier, earned a silver rating and gold sight reading award. Congratulations to the bands for their fine work. Hobart Key Club walked away with the following distinguished state awards. Club President Elena Palazzato, Club Treasurer Alexa Ray, Club Webmaster Lily Cole Ross, First Place Scrapbook Kiwanis Advisor Larry Barassas, Club Award First Place Swing Dancing Elena Palazzato and Lily Cole Ross. This recognition would not have been possible without the tremendous service that all members have put in this year. Over 1,000 hours of service and over 15 service projects completed. Amazing job, everyone. Congratulations, Key Clubbers. Congratulations to Havoc, the winner of the Key Club Cutest Dog Contest. Havoc is owned by Emily Reppert. Thank you for all who participated. Now over to Connor for what's happening at HHS. Juniors and seniors who have bought prom tickets can still purchase this t-shirt. See Mrs. Krieg or Mrs. Slow if interested. There's still some senior apparel items left. Check with Mrs. Nelson if interested. Key Club will be hosting its fourth annual Prado Willy Walk for Research on Saturday, May 19th on our track at 11 a.m. It's a one hour walk. Registration is $10 and can be done ahead of time or on that day. Put it on your calendar if you can join us. Now back over to Carson and Ian for some more announcements. Join the HHS fitness movement. 10 to 15 minutes after you eat lunch on Thursdays, meet Coach Osika or Coach Eubank in the Great Hall for basketball. Outdoor Walking Club will begin again in April once the weather warms up. Bricky Ambassadors will be accepting applications for members through April 20th. The Ambassadors are an important part of our school culture and play an important role in soothing their transition to high school for new students. Applications are available from the main office. Stop by to pick one up or talk to a current member for details if you would like to serve as a mentor for incoming students. The dates are set for summer school. There will be two sessions and the first session will run from June 4th to the 21st. The second session will run from July 9th to the 26th. Classes will run Monday through Thursday from 7.30 a.m. until 1.30 p.m. Since each session is only 12 days, there will be a strict attendance policy. Applications and details will be available from guidance in March. Attention all Aladdin Jr. cast and crew. Remember that you have mandatory rehearsals every day, including Saturday and Sunday. See Mrs. Nelson if you have any questions. The online HHS newspaper is coming back bigger and better than ever. We are asking for students to submit pictures of artwork or original pieces of writing to appear in the art section of the paper. Please see Mrs. Nelson with questions in 1113. If you have something to submit, send it to the yearbook address at hhsyearbook3 at gmail.com. Students, did you know there is a sharing table in the lunchroom? Instead of throwing away unopened food or pieces of fruit, you can put them in the cooler located under the new sign by the courtyard door so someone else can use them. It's a win-win. You are not wasting food, and someone who's hungry can make use of it. Thanks for your participation. If you haven't done so already, please be sure to subscribe to Hobart High School Radio and Television on YouTube to get all the latest updates and announcements. And that wraps it up for today's announcements. I'm Carson. And I'm Ian. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day HHS. HHS.